Hey folks, welcome to another VR video. Today I'm playing Vertical Robots Daedalus on the Gear VR with Gear VR controller. Uh, the controller is kind of a cool model here. Kind of cool to look at. So we're going to start with stage one, obviously. This is a tutorial level. Use the controller to point in the direction you want to jump and pull the trigger. All right. Oh, neat. So it's like I'm a little like gliding bird here. Let's see if I can get on here. All right, all right. That's cool. Alright, let's soar up here to this next floor. We'll recharge. Alright, and one more. Find and land on the three triangles to open the gate, okay? One, one triangle. See if I can get to the next one here. There's two triangles. And there we go. We're going to make it to the third triangle. This is an awesome game so far. So let's see. This is opening. This triangle pathway here. And now it's going on. Is that a level? All right. So I'm assuming this is the second level. I'm also assuming I probably want to land on this triangle. There we go. There's a triangle. Probably do not want to land in the black tar like buildup there. So it's, it's fairly simple gameplay mechanics, but it's super fun. And it's a bit immersive. So now I have to turn a little bit here. Alright. So. Whoa. Alright. Don't want to die. Shoot up like a rocket. Soar right there. And now comes the challenging part because I think I'm going to need to turn all the way around. Yeah. So I didn't realize the white circle here seems to be the energy meter. The glide here will get us to that wall. Soaring up and onto the ground. And up. And end of level. <coughs> see what they've got for us next. Land on the round column or triangle to save your progress. Well, definitely want to save my progress. But I really like how it recognizes from a angle perspective. Uh, this is the first game that I really feel like on 
Gear VR with the controller is using the direction of the controller um, to judge. There's the first triangle. But yeah, the direction of, of the triangle and how it's being pointed makes all the difference in this one. And, and that's impressive to me. Um, I'm, I'm, every time I use the Gear VR controller, I'm more impressed with how it's been implemented in the games. Uh, unfortunately, the Daydream controller almost feels like... I don't want to say an inferior product, because it's not. Um, but even though it's got pretty much the same functionality, with the exception of there's an extra button on the Gear VR controller, the Gear VR controller seems to be implemented a lot better than the Daydream controller has been. I just want to check one other thing here. I'm noticing not hearing any sound as I play. And that would be because I didn't have the volume up. Definitely want to check out the sound in the game as well here. So let's see here. So there's a big furry thing. Not sure what I'm supposed to do with this. So I'm going to go ahead and take the stairs here. From a gameplay perspective, again, kind of a simple concept. But tons of fun so far. Let's see, can I make it? Nope. But I can make it to this triangle over here. I need to turn around again. I hate to have to keep going with my back to folks, but it seems to be the only way to complete these levels. Alright. I'll head back toward the triangle over here. Wow, and so level design has gotten more and more complex each level as well, which is awesome. Let's take a look here. I'm going to try to go up as high as I can. Uh-oh. Well, that didn't work out. Down did it. Let's try this one. I found a single triangle so far. I don't think it's the triangle I'm looking for. Oh, I see. So, I appear to need to get as high up as possible because the triangles... Whoa! Descend from above. Alright, let's see if I can shoot up here. up one. So what I like is this is kind of just a platformer. But with the most unique platformer controller mechanics I've ever played. Alright, so let's see. I'm assuming I need to go up a little bit further because I only see two triangles there. And there's always a third.
Whoa. Just got very, very dark. I see the two triangles, but not the third. The one behind me, maybe. No. Perhaps I should have gone for the other two, because I don't see where the third one may be. Uh oh. Let's see what happens if we fall into a chasm here. Goodbye, cruel world! Alright. Let's try to get up to that top one more time. Or not. I think this is a good place to call it quits anyway. Hope you enjoyed the video this week. This was Daedalus on the Gear VR. It's a really interesting gameplay mechanic. I love how it in integrates the Gear VR controller. Lots of great games coming out. This week alone, Defense Grid 2, Cloudlands Mini Golf, several other games have all come out that integrate this controller in innovative ways. Daedalus definitely does that. There's so much potential in this little box right now for your smartphone, and I'm really excited to see what else transpires now that the Gear VR controller is kind of coming to fruition and maturing into a viable control method and input method. Until next time, get out there and enjoy some VR for yourself, whether it be Gear VR, Cardboard, Daydream, Vive, Rift, PSVR, NOLO, you name it. I'll be back with more content soon. Until next time, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.